must say. His dad brought it back from patrol. G'day cheeky dogs, my name's Monkey and I'm an Australian currently living in America. Today we're going to be talking about the names of Rusty's mum and dad. Now Rusty's family all has actually really iconic names or really like Australian names, which is why I think that the names of his mum and dad would also be just as special. And Digger, you thought Christmas up north was hot, you should try over here, it is boiling. I've already done like a breakdown before of all the kids names in like previous videos, so I'll link like my Rusty videos up here, but I'll do a very quick re brief. Rusty is named Rusty after Joe Brum, the creator of Bluey's own dog, the show is initially going to be about Rusty. And a fun fact is that Red Kelpies have had the nickname Bluey in the past as well, so it's kind of like a fun little connection there. Yeah, Rusty! Dusty is named after another famous Red Kelpie from a book called Dusty. Rusty's older brother Digger is of course a nickname for an Australian soldier which links Digger with his dad who's in the army and just a perfect little reference there. I think that also is key for Rusty's dad's name as well and I'll get to that. Mom! There's a letter from Dad! I should also point out that Dusty's name is technically a male name. The book is about a male dog. So I feel like a lot of these like dog names they can be used for either gender and only sometimes might they sound a little bit more feminine or masculine. So let's look at all the names then that we have as our contenders. Some other famous Red Kelpie names are Coco, Cloud, Gunner, Tally Ho, Red and Barb. Out of those six, I feel like Coco, whilst it's a great feminine name, is just kind of out straight away because we already have a Coco in the show. Can't change the rules, Coco! Aww, why not? If you didn't know, Coco is the name of the dog actor that played Red Dog in the famous movie Red Dog. And of course we're going to talk about Red Dog because he's probably the most famous Australian Red Kelpie. So the name Red could definitely, I think, be used for Rusty's dad. It's very much a sort of male name and it would be like a funny joke as well with their last name being Kelpie and his name being Red. So Red Kelpie kind of like, you know, mixes it together. For those of you who don't know who Red Dog is, he is a dog who lived for eight years and basically traveled the whole of Western Australia, which is literally half of our country. He had multiple owners. He was like a dog for everyone. He also had multiple different names as well, including Tally Ho, which we'll get to. But he was even owned at one point by a bank who actually gave him an actual bank account and then had a whole motto of, if Red Banks at Wales, then so should you. Cheeky bugger. So the fact that this has had a whole movie made out of it, I feel like Red is a really big contender for what Rusty's dad's name could be. But let's talk about Tally Ho as well, which was one of Red's nicknames, alongside also Bluey, which again is really funny. But Tally Ho, I think is like a really fun name and it does have a bit of like a military connotation with it because it's usually used initially in Britain as like when people were like hunting foxes, they'd say Tally Ho, I've seen the target, let's go. US military use it for their air force as well. So it does have that kind of like military link, but I feel like the name Tally Ho just maybe seems a little bit too silly maybe for Rusty's dad. So Telly Ho Kelpie, I don't know if it really quite rings the right bell. Just keep your eye on the ball and take care of your little sister for me. Love, Dad. Which then leaves us with my last choice, which is my number one choice for Rusty's dad name, and that is Gunner. Now, Gunner was a famous Kelpie back in 1941 and was associated with the military. This dog called Gunner, he would actually alert the Australian soldiers when he could hear the enemy aircraft approaching Darwin during World War II. He was an official member of the RAAF and he was called Gunner because of that rank, which in other countries would be like the rank of private. But he was officially instated into it. He was a full on military dog. He was found by people there. He had a broken leg. They like nursed him back to health and then he helped them out. He's hanging out with them all the time. So he had this really big link with the Australian military during World War II. So again, of course, with Rusty's dad being in the army, I feel like that's a really beautiful link again together of maybe his dad could be called Gunner. Rusty? Dad's letter has a PS for you. Can you read it? This tiny sounds like he's got some pace on him. He does. I wish I could be there to bowl a few at you, but I can't right now, mate. So that then leads us on to Rusty's mum. And so her options again were Coco, Cloud or Barb. Coco, we've already ruled out, of course, but we also have Barb. And Barb, I think, 
I don't know, it could kind of work. It's a very like Aussie nickname for Barbara. The name Barb actually comes again from one of the earliest Kelpies in Australia. So it was back in like the 1800s. And this dog was called Barb after the famous Australian horse called The Barb who had won the Melbourne Cup that year. The only thing against this though is the fact that Barb the Kelpie was a black Kelpie, not a red Kelpie like how we see Rusty's whole family. So that could be the only thing that really kind of says that maybe her name's not Barb. Which then leads into the option of maybe her name is Cloud, which I love and it is my number one pick. It's got a real kind of like feminine sound to it and Red Cloud Kelpies was like the sort of really popular name to call Kelpies that had like a little like fluffy white patch on their chest. And again, they were very specific to red Kelpies, not black ones or blue ones. And the name Red Cloud came really popular in like the late 1800s, early 1900s by a man called John Quinn who bred a lot of Kelpies and was quite famous for it in Australia. The name also became really popular again in the 1960s around Western Australia and a lot of people called their Red Kelpies Cloud or Red Cloud. And considering that Rusty's mom also has like a little patch on her chest, I mean, the whole family does but she's got like a little like cloudish looking patch. Perhaps that means then that her name is Cloud. So Cloud and Gunner were my two picks for Rusty's mom and dad's name. But let me know in that comment section down below. What name do you think that they have? Do you think it could be Coco, Gunner, Tally Ho, Barb, Red? Whatever ideas you have, let me know in that comment section down below. And while you're there, don't forget to hit that like button as well as that subscribe button and that bell for notifications so you know whenever I release any other Bluey videos. Until then though, I've picked your cheeky dogs out a few other videos that maybe you would like to watch and I will see you all in another video. Mwah. Bye!